thank you so much for accepting the interview. And what's your name and where are you from? I'm Nell uh, and I'm from Switzerland, Europe. Which part of the Switzerland are you from? Um, from the French part. So people in Switzerland speak German, Italian, French and another language. And I'm from this French speaking part. Oh, you, in your city, like there is so many languages. Yes, yes, four national languages. It, it's a lot. It's a lot. But people just, yeah. I mean, it's just a lot. That's surprising. You also speak like many multiple languages. Um, so my dad is Swiss, so I speak French, mm -hmm. and my mom is uh, Spanish, so mm -hmm. I speak uh, Spanish too. Um, I learned German in school, although it's not really good, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, English because it's you get a, you can't speak English anywhere. Mm -hmm. And now I'm trying to learn Japanese. You will learn like a lot of languages, right? Yeah, but I I feel like Europe is so small and has so many different languages that you learn you learn a lot like very quickly. Mm -hmm. That's really cool. What's the uh, impression Japan so far? So far, I love it. It's very different from what we have in Europe. Um, I love the the contrast between um, temples and like shrines, and then you have like the the city and all the noise. And I really like it because we have like uh, temples, but like it's not the same. Like we have churches in Europe and stuff, but here I think it's like has a more more of a presence, mm. so I really like it. and also like the parks and stuff. It's it's really cool. I yeah, really nice. like it. Yeah. Also, like what um, makes you to uh, move uh, in Japan? Are you um, leaving or? I guess that? I'm I'm leaving here. Um, uh, what did I? I wanted to move here because so I finished uh, my bachelor's degree back home, mm -hmm. and I had some time off, and I wanted to learn about a different country and a different, different culture mm -hmm. and Europe is nice but I mean I've traveled in Europe and I think I wanted to take the next step and and go somewhere else and I really loved Japan for a couple of years and so I wanted to I wanted to try and challenge myself to live in a country that's so different from mm -hmm. what we have home and uh, yeah that's why I wanted to move here and learn something different basically. Mm -hmm. nice. That's really great, challenging. Yes, it, I mean it is a challenge, but uh, you, I mean, it's good. I like I like to challenge myself. What, who are you trying for, like Japanese? Well, obviously, like ramen, sushi. Um, I have been. I'm living with um, with uh, some roommates, and one of them is Chinese, so he makes a lot of food. Um, I don't know the names though, um, and right now. I don't have anything in my particularly in mind, um, but like the very right now, I'm just a, still in the tourist uh, mindset. So, and I love ramen so much. I was in soba and all that, but I like ramen so much. I, I think I could eat that every day, honestly. So right now, I'm stuck with ramen, um, but I really want to try it, like yeah, different things. Right. Yes. Have you ever tried like any Japanese snack? Um. What is that? Yeah, um, well, mochi. Uh, also, like, between school breaks, I'll go to the, like, kombini and, like, find, like, my friends always ha buy, like, some little, um, yeah, sweets, and so I'll try them, but I don't know what their name is, so I'm so sorry. So, yeah, it's really, it's really different. It's also, it's really funny, because since I don't really know what it's written, like, I can hear, I can, I can, no, can uh, read hiragana and katakana and, like, some kanji, but like sometimes you don't know what you're buying and it's right. really fun. So yeah, and yeah, but I, I'm still eating a lot of like Western food at mm -hmm. home. So yeah, I, I have to learn how to cook uh, in the Japanese way. So one day you want to try? Oh yes, 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 yes. yes. I would love to. Mm -hmm. If you have any recommendations, I'll, I'll take them. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So, and also today I brought like some dessert and uh, snacks. So. Yeah. As a snack, we have a Kit Kat match day. Yes. And also, as a dessert, we have a like, chew cream with the cream pie. Yeah, okay. Which one would you like to try today? Which one is your favorite? Pie chew cream. Okay, well, I'll take that. Yeah. I wow. Yeah, I don't know. It's like there's so much to try. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I don't have enough time, you know. Yeah. Like, my. Mmm. It's so good. I'm sorry. 
and making a lot of noise. It's really good. Yeah. Mm. What's in it? So this is a uh, shoe cream with the. Uh, they have a, a cream and mm. also custard as well. It's and then so good. they're saying like intense uh, custard. Mm -hmm. That's what they. Uh, it's told. really tasty. Yeah. It's really good. Is there like other types of custard inside? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, there's sure? some uh, cream too. Mm. Yeah. yeah, here it, the, we have you have a lot of like sweets and stuff, and mm. I feel like I will never have enough time to try it all. It's like it's really good. So, living here like uh, one month, uh, what things you like to bring back to your country? Mm. Like, anything should be fine. I bought so many things already. I uh, I'm already planning on um, I'm bringing another big suitcase. Because I bought so many things. Um, what do I want to bring? Um, well, my siblings are fans of like Minecraft and anime, so yeah. I'm gonna bring lots of anime stuff. Obviously, um, I would love to bring like Japanese uh, craft. craft. Go? Is it, it's go? I mean, like I know the kanji for like like you know like um, Japanese like um, like uh, like. R Cups, you know, cups like and like um, plates, um, also knives, um, kitchen knives. Um, uh, kitchen knife. Yes. Um, so things that are very Japanese, I would. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm trying to do. And also, it's I'm going to back to see my family in, uh, for Christmas, so I'm gonna buy a lot of stuff for them and food. 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 I do want to bring food. Yeah. So you have many packs. In your back, right? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I well, I need to buy another suitcase. So basically, I'm it's gonna be heavy. But mm. my mom is coming is is going to get me at the airport back home. So with the car, so we'll we'll be good. But yeah, nice. Yeah, and a lot of people saying that Japanese cook knife they brought in yeah. your country. What's the reason for that? Are they like really functional? Or? I haven't uh, done enough research yet yeah. um, in Switzerland um, they will sell Japanese knife but sell it like very expensive price really? and so yeah so they're like oh well it's Japanese so it's more expensive um, I feel like maybe because of like the I don't know like um, why? it's a very good question and I'm not yeah. sure I have like a full answer but maybe I don't know maybe it's like the handcraft, it's made like it's yeah, like someone is making it for you, and also you can like write your name. He can write your name on it. Maybe something like that. Also, yeah, I don't. My knives in Switzerland suck, so I need new knives. Mm. So maybe yeah, I'll yeah, I'll buy one. Yeah. So thank you for all the answers. Um, please enjoy your Tokyo life and hope you learn Japanese as well. Yes, I I'll I'll do my best. Uh, thank you for accepting the interview. Uh, what's your name? My name is Anna. And I'm Socrates. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Same, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Where are you actually from? We're from, from Greece, Greece. But we live in London, in the UK. Oh, you're now living in UK? Yes, yes. London. How's the living over UK over there? It's really nice. I really like it. Mm. But I, I am kind of biased because my mother grew up there. Mm -hmm. And uh, London is one of my favorite cities in the world. Yeah. Not my favorite. But the food is terrible. <laughs> so this is why we enjoy food in Japan so yeah. much. The food here is amazing. <laughs> the food is not really good in UK. No, 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 absolutely not. <laughs> Unless you eat other foods, yeah. other, other cuisines. Yeah. That's really good. That was really surprising. And like, uh, how's the like uh, impression Japan so far? From the first moment, it's just. Amazing. The people are so kind and uh, yes. like you. <laughs> the weather is mm. fantastic. We have so much sun here and the food is brilliant. Absolutely. I feel, yeah, everyone is very kind mm. and we were surprised about the, um, the way that we communicate with the locals, even mm. though we can speak really good English really well. Mm -hmm. the, everyone is really kind. Mm. Yeah, and. Uh, we really like the, the bowing. <laughs> really? It's, it yeah. looks very, very kind, very nice. Yeah. <laughs> I was at the vending machine. I was trying to see, to see how it works. Mm -hmm. And we had two girls who helped us with the money. So mm. it was really 
really helpful. <laughs> so even though you were confused by the the one, but they help you. Yes, yes. the Lord, the yes. Lord. Mm-hmm. But we we had only because we we had travel money. We had only five thousand yen, mm. and I think the machine didn't accept the five thousand. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. So the the kind lady offered to give us five one thousand yen uh, mm-hmm. notes. Yeah, mm. yeah, very kind. Of thing. It's like it's in the culture, mm. in your culture to be so kind and uh, I don't know how you like tourists, but so far we've had a great experience as tourists. And everywhere is very clean, mm. even though we can find rubbish bins, we know that we have to take the rubbish with us, mm-hmm. but everywhere is very clean. Yeah. Fantastic, yes. And the greenery is amazing, it's mm. different colors of green mm. of what we have experienced in Europe. Mm. It's our first time uh, taking such a long trip. Oh, your first time. 14 hours yeah. flight, <laughs> but definitely worth it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. We had uh, to go to Copenhagen mm-hmm. and then fly 14 hours here. Mm. That's a long right? Yes, mm. but definitely worth it. Yeah, worth it. I really like it though. Even the economy class is absolutely fine because mm. you have so many things to wait for. That's true. Yeah, thanks for saying that. Mm. And then. Uh, what things do you do like to try in Japan as this trip? Yeah. Mm. Well, we want to visit a lot of shrines. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, the temples, they look amazing to us. The food. The food. Mm-hmm. All Definitely. kinds of food. Um, what else? I'm really looking forward to buying souvenirs and have matcha mm. and mm. tea because we don't have these in Europe. Mm. Or we have some matcha, but it's not a traditional one. Mm-hmm. Just experience everything I would say. Yeah, and see the nature. Mm. It looks fantastic. E- even in, in Tokyo, just walking in the parks is just really nice. Mm. I'm looking forward to the bullet train. We're taking oh, yeah. these on Wednesday. We're going to Hiroshima, mm. Kyoto, and Nintendo World because mm. we're fans of Super Mario. <laughs> yeah, we're looking, really looking forward to that as well. <laughs> yeah, bread train is really cool. That's what I heard from other people. Yeah? Really? Mm. Ah, and we want to take lots of gachapons. Oh, yeah. <laughs> gachapons. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of things from the convenience stores. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and we love the conven- It's convenient, isn't it? Yeah, convenience yeah, store. Wow. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I think that's. <laughs> yeah, I think that's, <laughs> that's all. <of> it. <laughs> a lot. What would you recommend? <laughs> For me, I would recommend that definitely gachapon is really fun. Yeah. And then, if you like gachapon, I think the uh, do you know like a um, UFO catcher? It's like a. Um, if you, you yeah, if you oh, pay yeah. the coin and then oh the, yeah, these uh, there are these you have these amazing stores, five stories uh, with games and, uh, mm. and arcades. I want to visit some arcades as well. We yeah, might, that's true. Yeah, yeah. We might do karaoke as well. <laughs> karaoke, yeah. W- would we find some English though? Some with subtitles in English. Yeah, of course. There is some uh, English uh, song as well. Okay, yeah. sure. Because I wouldn't do well in the Japanese songs. <laughs> But maybe you can try with Japanese song. <laughs> no. I, only, I only know how to spell sushi. I love the, the language as well. We're trying yeah. to learn a few words. Mm. Like the, how's the thank you? Origa, um, Arigato, Arigato gozaimasu. gozaimasu. Mm. I was saying correct. Yeah, it's really good yeah, Japanese, okay. yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so we're trying to learn a few words as well. But you want to run Japanese? In future. Just a little bit, <laughs> because I know some Chinese. Mm. I do this at the university, but I think Japanese are more, I don't know. I love the culture, the ikigai. Also, I've read lots of books about mm. Japanese and from Japanese authors. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely experienced Japan. It's our second day here, wow. and we were very jet lagged. <laughs> <laughs> so this is why we wanted to take some sun today. Yeah. It's the first day we had some good sleep because mm. we were sleeping for two or three hours for the past three days. Right. So now mm. we have. A great, a fantastic morning here. Mm. We're really gonna enjoy it. But by the way, you say you like yeah, gachapon, or y- you know very well for Japan uh, stuff. Uh, how do you oh. know? Or do you well, like yeah. it? Can we show a guy? Uh, of course, yeah. Another YouTuber, a British YouTuber. Takes with faith. Or you are guided to Japan. Yeah. Yes, it's really informative. Uh-huh. You should make your own one. Wow. <laughs> and you can do. Um, it has a lot of things. Uh-huh. And recommendations. Wow. <laughs> so we, we take, we have included what we want to uh-huh. try from here. See? Okonomiyaki. <laughs> <laughs>
There is so much like uh yeah the de- detail yeah ah uh, this is Even the budget our guys. budget <laughs> 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 we had to save for six seven months <laughs> to come also like uh, are there any like uh, surprise things or like memorable things went to a clothes shop. And every size is really small. <laughs> I was like, this is a medium. I need extra large. <laughs> That's true, yeah. It's yeah. very different from us yeah, because different. we have the small for us is large here. Mm. It's very surprising. <laughs> That's true, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, even though for men, as a cross, yeah. like, uh, medium size would be uh, in US, would be S size. So really? It's like uh, the one side is down. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the style. I think everyone's very stylish. Men and mm-hmm. women. You mean oh, yeah. their clothes? Yeah. yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone looks really nice. I'm really well... Um, uh... Men? No. Uh... Take, uh, taking care. I can't find the word. Mm. Yes. Right, right, right. What, what do you think of the uh, fashion? Do you... Well, uh, what's the impression of them? So It's like more different? Well, I know you have the anime. I'm mm-hmm. not a fan of anime, mm-hmm. to be honest, but I love the clothing, the skirts, and mm-hmm. how girls are dressing, mm-hmm. and, and men. Yeah, I find it kind of formal of, mm-hmm. in comparison with what we have in the Western community. We yeah. used to have like uh, sportswear a lot, mm-hmm. and I like that here you don't wear um, gym clothes outside. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Do you, uh, you will go out like a clothes shop uh, in future, this trip? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, we, we have some shopping plans. Mm. Yeah, a lot. A lot we, of we brought half empty suitcases mm. to fill them here. Right. I think a Uniqlo is the good too, uh, yeah. as a cross, mm-hmm. and also GU mm-hmm. is the uh, not not uh, really a high prices, it's reasonable price. And yes. the, uh, the, the cross taste is pretty good. Yeah, okay, mm. okay, definitely. I like the tennis. I like tennis a lot, mm. and I think Roger Federer is the one who's uh, who wears Uniqlo. Right. That's so true. I know that that brand, and I, yeah, I want to buy a few things from there. Yeah, he's I think uh, Uniqlo sponsored by him. Yeah. Mm. Okay. You only stayed two days, but I think you seen like many different cultures. Yes. So, so what things you would like to bring back your country? Like anything should be fine. Like. You mean, you, upon? <laughs> you mean like yeah. physical things to touch or just mm-hmm. experiences? So, I, w- I would love to take photos and mm-hmm. show them. And if we can, food, maybe something with food, matcha, the tea, mm-hmm. gatsapons. I, I really like the, um, the charms. Is it charms? Like the charms mm-hmm. you have? Mm-hmm. I think it's like small envelopes, something yeah. like that. Mm-hmm. You've seen them. So some of these. Mm-hmm. You mean a charm? Yeah, something. Can I show you? Yeah, yeah. Ah, it says <laughs> good luck charms from a temple or shrine. Oh, okay. We call us the, uh, maybe, uh, Omamori. Ah, it's I like, think, yeah, 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 I think yeah. so, yeah. yeah. It must be it, yeah. Sure, I can't find it now. Mm-hmm. You? Kit Kats. The Kit Kats? Kit Kats. Yes. <laughs> uh, some sweets from mm-hmm. the convenience stores. I love the cheesecake that you mm. have, the oh, fluffy yes. creamy cheesecake, something like yeah. that. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's really Fantastic. Good. Yeah. We have lots of them as snacks. <laughs> <laughs> right. right. We... You say that you like Japanese snacks so, and then mm. Kit Kat. Mm. And yeah. then you haven't tried matcha yet. Right? Not yet. No. Not yet. No. <laughs> not, not here. Mm. We tried, uh, we prepared a bit in London. Mm-hmm. There are a couple of places. And, uh, oh, in terms of food, we, did, we didn't mention the... Okonomiyaki. No, I said that. <laughs> <Okonomiyaki>. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we, we tried it in London at a very nice place. And mm-hmm. uh, yeah, we were looking forward to having it here as well. Yeah, 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 definitely. You will try. And then today I also brought the uh, Kit Kat with matcha taste. Would you like to try one? Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Thanks so Thank much. you very much. Thank, Thank you very much. Yeah. Very kind of you. Thank you. Can you. Have... Wow. So this is uh, like Kit Kat and then uh, usually put chocolate, but... We made it up with the matcha. With matcha, okay. Mm. I think we also had matcha tea at the aer- at the airplane. In yeah. The airplane. Mm, yes, when good. we were coming. I can't open it. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Try from here. Ah, did you like it? Mmm. Mmm. How's it taste? It's really good. 
Mm. I can't really taste the matcha. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can't really see the matcha. Let me try some more. Mm. Mm. No, it's really nice. It's fantastic. Mm. Wow. Mm. Thank you. The matcha is really good. And we had matcha ice cream before, so it reminds me oh, kind of okay. the taste mm. of the matcha ice cream. But it's really nice. Yeah, thank you. Okay, all right. <laughs> it was really good to know. As long as it has chocolate, I love it. <laughs> mm. And I love Kit Kat, so it's really nice that you have this. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Thank you very yeah. much. Hope you like it. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I love it. Would. Mm. We'll go buy some more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can just give you more. Yeah, yeah. No, no. Later, yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you very much. We're really happy to you like it. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> well, I think we're not very fans of the tea. It's very strong for us mm. because we haven't had anything similar. Mm -hmm. But ice cream is really good. This was amazing. Yeah, I think we'll with Matsu. Mm -hmm. right so far. So thanks for all the answers and uh, hope you enjoy Tokyo life and uh, Japan life. Thank you very much. It was really nice meeting you. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah. How are you? Doing great. Really thank great. you so much. Awesome. Yeah. Where are you guys actually from? Uh, New, Jersey. New Jersey, United States. That's really nice, yeah? yeah. How long the uh, flight? 14 hours straight. Luckily, right to the Honda Airport. It was pretty nice. Not bad. We went United. It's pretty good. Not too far, right? No, not too far. I mean, uh, one one shot and then in Honda Airport, like 20 minutes from here, from Shinjuku or Shibuya, which are really great areas if you're going to come visit. Definitely recommend. Really nice. Yeah, really good. Uh, what brought you in Japan? I guess we've always loved... Bit, um, yeah. Two things. More, we've been planning for a while now. Yeah. Plus, we've always loved the culture, like the art style. We've always loved anime as well, but the food and everything. So we're just like, let's, let's do it, you know? It's finally time. Finally, after yeah. the COVID and after everything. Yeah, especially the shutdown. Yeah. We booked this trip in March. Yeah. Yeah. Since March. March? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, we really wanted to come. For sure. yeah. It's been more than half a year, right? Yes. Yeah, more than half a year we've been waiting, but it was definitely worth the wait. Yes. 100%. Yeah. How do you feel right now? Great. Great. I, I mean, I really love the people. I mean, honestly, if you're going to come to Japan, Learn a little bit of language, be respectful, learn a little bit of the customs. It goes a long way. I think the people here are very welcoming. Just, you know, I, I think people just think, oh, you know, Americans, it's like, for us at least, it's like, we've gotten great response. And I think people here are really awesome. Yeah. Uh, good to know, it really. Uh, by the way, I really like your clothes. Like, <laughs> this is the old school, this is kind of how we got into it, you know, when we were kids. Where did you buy, by the way? Uh, I think we went to like one of the like novelty stores by us in the United States, mm. for mine at least, with the helmet and everything. Yeah. Mine was online. There. Online. Amazon? <laughs> no, it was so online. I <laughs> they only had the Yellow Ranger. Um, Amazon available. did not pay for this production. <laughs> <laughs> it's free. You just bought it. Yes. But you actually brought your closet costume from yeah, your country. From there, we figured if we're going to celebrate Halloween, we'd do it right. Yeah. yeah. Dress up and everything. <laughs> What's the reason to choose your like hero? Did you like it? I've when always loved Power it? Rangers. Yeah, the Red Ranger was a big thing when I was a kid. That was probably my main superhero as far as me growing up. Well, the Red Ranger OG, you know? Red Ranger. Hey, hey, Red Ranger was still OG and he stayed for most of the series. True, but Tommy, Tommy's the guy. Started red, then green, then white, but Red was OG. He also kind of looks like him. <laughs> I don't know about that. I think so. Well, <laughs> maybe, maybe if you change. You know. Right, that's what I said. That's what I said. <laughs> so you really like it when you were a child of food. Yeah, and it's always carried through. Yeah, definitely. But how did you watch? Uh, is that United States famous to watch that Hero City? Uh, we actually had on on the TV series. It would play like every Saturday, every Sunday on the weekends, and then yeah, it's reruns, and then. From uh, Money Morphin to Turbo to Alpha to all, all of the series. To Neo to Dino Thunder. Exactly, exactly. To Space Force. <laughs> right, I didn't know that. What's uh, any uh, impression of Japan so far? Uh, it's been really great. I mean, people are welcoming, culture is really awesome, food's been amazing, yes. and just I mean everything. I think everyone should eventually try to come here. Just spread spread the love around the world. You know, I think it's just that uh, a lot of countries are very secluded, and this is just such a welcoming country. And I know, like, I, like my family's from Europe, and I get it. Sometimes in Europe, it's very, you know, touchy. But here, it's been really great. I mean, I don't think we've ever had one bad person interact. Everyone's been, been super amazing. awesome. Really great. Again, people are amazing. Um, we're 
definitely gonna come back. Yeah, 100%. Sure. <laughs> you can't do it in one trip, you gotta come multiple yes. times. Yes. <laughs> I wanna visit all of them. Yes. Yeah. yeah, thanks so much for saying that. You're I a mean, prime example. <laughs> <laughs> thanks that has nothing to do with that. us, the people here are just awesome. Yeah. <laughs> you too, yeah. <laughs> Is there like excited thing or like you want to must do in when you come in Japan? Right? Well, technically we went to go see the Yokohama Gundam Factory. Uh, we did that. Uh, the, the Tokyo Sky Tree. Uh, we're also going uh, to Kyoto, so uh, to a lot of the shrines over there and Osaka. Um, we're actually going to a swordsmith in Kyoto to actually work with a swordsmith and build a blade. So that was that. I've always wanted to make a blade since I was a kid with a blacksmith. So there's, I mean, there's and sword and sword cutting. And also sword practicing samurai cutting experience. Wow. Yeah, really? Tamashigiri, yeah, in Kyoto. You say you were going to see the Gundam. You, do you like also Gundam as well? Uh, we actually do uh, model kits. So we paint and, and, build, and build them. Yeah, we hand paint them. So the model kits, like uh, all the 1100 series, 1144s. Uh, we have a uh, page I do, Mecha Frames on Instagram, mm -hmm. hashtag Mecha Frames. Uh, really? Where I actually do designs and I paint them uh, Gundam and I post it online. Okay. Yeah. I soon to be doing stickers and t-shirts, so <laughs> yeah. Wow. I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> Is that your like part of a job or just doing as a hobby? As a hobby. Yeah. She, she started actually... We both met each other. Yeah, she was actually part of a group that hosts in the United States. They have groups that uh, go out, they teach people how to use it, how to paint and everything and the culture. And I just did it on the side and I went to the, one of the events and we kind of hit it off. Yeah. So we had to hit Gun the Factory. Yeah, that was number one. Yeah. <laughs> number one. Yeah. So you're actually like painting the uh, Gundam? Or yeah. yeah, we built it. Yeah, the, well, actually build the it. model kit. So it comes in sheets, you cut it down, you, you file it down, you hand paint it, and then we do photography on it. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Please show me uh, like later. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. Like to see yeah. Yeah, yeah. Are there any like shop or like difference between your country and Japan? Technically, I would say the food shops. Yeah. The, the trend clothes. Mm. Amazing. Super here. chic here. Oh my really goodness. chic. Yeah, over there is more conservative. I would say the, really the nice. clothes over oh, here are. Yeah. Amazing. I wish I could bring that culture back. Yeah. I love it. I do like the street avenues, the way everything's like kind of close together. It feels almost more like home like, you know, it's everything's really ni uh, uh, nicely uh, wound together. I feel like the community is really nice. Yeah. So, you actually want to back our Japanese course to your country? I wish. <laughs> yeah. I want yeah, that'd be awesome. Yeah. Yes. Well, what kind of course do you see so far? Like, just the street or? The street clothes. I mean, like even the jackets, uh, a lot of the pants, or like even the waistwear, like the belts, are just a different kind of style. They're a little bit sleeker, a little bit more modern, and I really like that. Yeah, I think it's really cool. Especially some of the, the female like, coats. They have like a really extravagant hoodies, and they have like all the backs, the back parts, and they have all the details. And I like yeah. that. It's very, very unique. Yeah. Mean, New York has style too. Right. But it's different. I, I feel like I kind of want to bring it over to New York. I feel like it would be a nice merge, a nice blend. Even though compared to New York, Tokyo have unique way oh, for yeah. fashion. 100%. I think it's just, even like the streets are well more lit, super clean. New York, yeah, I mean, there, there is something to it, you know? <laughs> <laughs> How's the New Jersey as well? I think that jazz is famous, but... Jersey's cool. It's not as, um, it's not as populated. It's, it's more open land. <laughs> Yeah, which is nice, but New York is, is the city, you know, but Tokyo is pretty awesome. As far as cities go, definitely on top. Definitely on top, 100%. <laughs> you experienced like uh, many things so far in Japan, but like what things you would like to bring back to your country? The transportation as far as the, the train system, super efficient. Honestly, puts us to shame. Uh, I'll say it, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It just, it just is what it is. Super nice. Um, also, the food, it's a lot more of a... Uh, I guess it would be uh, a lot of different food. It's more accessible, easier, in a lot more places. In, in Jersey, New York, you do have to kind of find the spots. And there's not a lot of, you know, there's like only a few spots that are like really good. And then and the rest are okay. Here, everything's awesome. And I think yeah. here, for a really good quality dish, the price is affordable. And I, it's nice because it makes you want to keep coming back and eating more of it because it's affordable, it's delicious. Mm -hmm. I feel like over there it's a little overpriced. Um, so that would be great if we could bring down the prices over there and bring more quality.
quality from Japan would be nice. So like it's more reasonable on the way like the food is good. Oh, oh yes. yeah, great, super good. Yeah. High, high quality food for sure. Yeah. Even the drinks, the, the apple juice. Also, the, the vending machines. I like that there's vending machines everywhere to access yeah. drinks and stuff. Instead of having to go to stores, that is really cool. I do like that. That is super cool. What are the difference between the uh, vending machines? The vending machines there are just like basic sodas. Mm -hmm. It's like Coca-Cola, Sprite, mm -hmm. Dr. Pepper, Ponza maybe. But this is like you have apple juice, you have energy drinks, you have coffee, coffee you have matcha, oh you have a tea, you have iced tea, you have you have such a selection. It's for everybody. Yeah. Over there is just sugar. <laughs> yeah, just one kind of sugar drink and that's it. Here you have more variety. Yeah, okay. By the way, I really like Corvus and uh, thank you for the interview. Oh, of course, no problem. I think I'm going to Hope you enjoy the I will, we will. <laughs> Yeah, so thank you for accepting the interview. Uh, where are you guys actually from? Uh, Australia, Melbourne. Melbourne. Melbourne? Yeah. yeah. I've been interviewing like two people. In okay. Melbourne. Oh, oh okay. really? Yeah, yeah wow. Um, yeah, it's, it's easy for us to get here because there's direct flights yeah. straight up and it's not that expensive, so it's, it's easy to visit. Mm. I'm different, it's not big, right? It's, it's only like one hour. One hour. And I think on October 1st, it goes yeah, to the same. Yeah, because we have daylight savings. Yeah. It goes mm. and then it comes Yeah. Uh, what brought you in Japan? My father was a airline pilot out of Narita for nearly 20 years. Um, so I've been here many, many times, but um, my wife hasn't. I've never been. Yeah. So we were coming and visiting and uh, wanted to show her Japan. So. But that was a surprise. Yeah, he um, came over a very long time ago uh, because there was some airline uh, things that happened in Australia. And then, yeah, came here. What the things would you really like to try? us this trip. Food. Definitely food. Yeah, we, we We've already love. tried a couple of new things. Yeah. Like eel. Eel. Which yeah. was interesting. Okonomiyaki delicious. and uh, sushi. Um, yeah. Lots of different things. Matcha ice cream. Mm. And I spilt it all over myself. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, the food. And then also, it's just a beautiful country. There's lots of um, beautiful things to see. So, yeah. Have you ever uh, tried Japanese food in Melbourne? Yes. Yes, we love Japanese food. Uh, mm. So we have it all the time in Australia, but it's much better here. What the uh, like specific food in Melbourne? Japan is like sushi or... Uh... Mm. Good question. <laughs> yeah. We talk about it all the time. Um, Australia is hard. We don't have like specific food because it's such a it multicultural always, yeah. kind of com country. There's lots of different uh, cuisines. cuisines. And they tend to originate from different places that aren't actually... Yeah, what is it? Vegemite? Vegemite, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tim uh, Tams? Yeah, it's, yeah, Tim Tams, Pavlova, all that sort Tim of stuff. Tim Tams. Yeah. yeah. My friends give me that. Oh, uh, yeah? yeah. Do you like it? Yeah, with the milk, right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. That's uh... More snacks that are traditional yeah, to I think so. Australia. Yeah, um, rather than like specific kinds of foods, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. I would try that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What's the impression Japan so far? It's lo Beautiful. Love it. Yeah, it's a yeah. very... Uh, neat. Um, everyone's very polite, yep. um, and uh, people are lovely, and it's, it's a beautiful place, and uh, the food is great. Uh, it's very humid. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, very different heat to Australia. Yeah. It's very yeah. dry. It's very hot in Australia, but it's drier. It's very. It's much more humid here. Yeah. We we don't get much humidity in Australia at all. Um. So it's. Yeah, it, that's probably the main thing. But it's it's still lovely. It's nice yeah. that it's warm. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Like, uh, what's uh, like any difference between uh, Melbourne and Japan so far? I think, uh, at least in Melbourne, we have pretty good public transport actually. Uh, but the I think the the way that the architecture looks and everything, there's a lot. It's there's a lot more like neon and mm. um, signs and things like that. Mm. Obviously, the food as well. Um, and the language, <laughs> yeah. language, yeah. Um, but that's what do you think? Yeah, I think as well. Our public transport's good, but lots of your systems are more organised, and yeah, yeah, they make a bit more sense. I think. Yeah. What's the most like excited things that you want to try in Japan? I think we were really, really excited for the food, yeah. Um, in particular, because we love Japanese food, uh, but also just to see uh, all the beautiful things um we haven't uh, so like in, in tokyo and kyoto and um 
yeah, everywhere along the south coast is where we're headed. So just wanted to see all the beautiful sights. The bullet train. Bullet That'd train. be cool because I've yeah. never been on Yeah. You actually going the uh, Osaka Kyoto too? Just, yes. Yeah. Like uh, there is some uh, Japanese food I'd recommend, like okonomiyaki or yeah. takoyaki. takoyaki. Those are really yeah, good. Great. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, yeah. Okay. We'll have to give that a try. Okonomiyaki. Yeah. yeah. Okonomiyaki is your favorite. Yeah. Have you tried before or? Well, we, we've had it in Australia yeah. um, and we had it a couple of days ago. Um, yeah, uh, near Sensuji. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, and that was amazing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Do you book any uh, restaurant or no? Just we, just going? The way that, anything. Yeah, only yeah. hotels. Yeah. Uh, well, the way that we travel is a lot more uh, relaxed. We, okay. we, don't, we try not to book over lots, lots and lots of things yeah. because we like to sort of just explore and do things one at a time so we haven't booked any restaurants no mm-hmm. yeah so you just want to go in yeah and then see that what, what she goes yeah um we get recommendations online and, and stuff but uh if we everywhere we've showed up so far that we've been able to get into so it hasn't been an issue well things or culture like would you like to bring back in melbourne if it's possible i love the um the style and the aesthetic uh of the japanese architecture and everything um everything is very like purposeful yeah if that makes sense uh you d- it doesn't seem like there's wasted space at any point um and everything's very practical yeah and safe yeah everything is very practical mm. and safe so uh probably just a little bit more of that i think in our lives um is probably the thing that i think what about you yeah same thing yeah yeah cook more Japanese food as well <laughs> right. yeah yeah and the way you um the trains are mm. like on the inside the way yeah. they're designed is just much mm. more practical as well yeah that's true yeah yeah I'm really uh curious about the architecture like yeah are there any difference between Melbourne and Japan architecture yes like, mm. yes definitely it's uh, Australia is very uh British uh mm. in if that makes sense i mean we are a british colony so it's it's very in, like english um european looking mm-hmm. compared to here which is uh, definitely um very, very very different so yeah i'd say that's the main thing right. so, anything you think no. the neon the neon yeah very, the neon very... signs the neon signs uh in in tokyo yeah. all of the bright like lights lit up at night everything. oh yeah, yeah it's yes. not like that it's not like that yeah <laughs> is it like out of the kaizen yeah, like the advertising. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 There is really unique, right? Yeah, very yeah. unique. Yes. Yeah. yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. Do you like it over there? Yeah, oh, we love the. Yeah, signs. love the neon. It's sign. beautiful. Yeah. Reserved, I think, maybe in Melbourne. Um, yeah. I don't exactly know why, but yeah. yeah. I'm really glad to know, like, about you guys' opinion. Yeah. Thank you for uh, having us interview. Like, hope you enjoy in Tokyo. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for accepting the interview. Where are you guys far from? So we're both from Ireland. Ireland? Yeah. Yes. We live in the UK, we live in mm-hmm. London, but uh, we're from Ireland originally. Yeah. What sports you uh, came in Japan? Like, what's the reason behind it? Uh, well, I think we've always wanted to go. Yeah, some, some fun to do. Uh, I think we wanted to in 2019, then COVID hit, mm-hmm. so we couldn't come for a while. Like after COVID? Uh, you just want to come. Yeah, yeah. Really. Yeah, yeah. And we really like, you know, we like anime. <laughs> yeah, and like anime. Oh, we do, yeah. I do, yeah, yeah. It was just, I've always been fascinated with Japan, so I've always been. Oh, what anime, by the way? Oh, you watch? I think anything it's really. Guys yeah, are like Spy X Family, uh, One Piece. One Piece? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's been on the Netflix right now. Yeah, yeah it's like live action yeah. there. Like, what's there like any impression in oh. Japan so far? Friendly. Very friendly. Everyone really? Friendly. Very super friendly. friendly. Um, um, very warm. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it's like, it's very friendly and quiet. Uh, cause yeah, we, like, we're from, quiet. we live in London and it's so loud all the time. Yeah. So, yeah. Especially on the trains. The trains mm-hmm. in London are really loud. Everyone talks really loudly mm-hmm. and here it's very quiet. Nice. <laughs> it's nice. And this park is beautiful, so it's just very nice. So it's like quiet compared to uh, London. Yeah. Yeah. Train. Well, the yeah. Bits, uh, yeah, the bits we've seen are quieter. I, I, I mean, we've just arrived. Just arrived. <laughs> yeah. How long uh, you will stay uh, in Japan? Two weeks. Two, two weeks. weeks. Two weeks. And then, uh, so it's like Tokyo, Kyoto, 
Nara, Osaka, and then back to Tokyo. Yeah. Oh, you went to, are uh, you gonna go a lot of places? Yeah. 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 Uh, do you already have a plan for the like, Kyoto or Nara or just uh, you know, um, no problem. Well, Kyoto, I think just go see the main sites. I'd love to go to the bamboo forest. Have you been? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and then in Nara, the deer park for yeah. sure. I'm very excited for the deer park. <laughs> are you from Tokyo yourself or are you from another city in Japan? Uh, actually, I'm uh, from Tokyo, but I was born in Nara. Oh, cool. Deer place. Really? Oh, oh yeah. my gosh, so exciting. And is the deer park as good as I think it's going to be? Yeah, it's gonna be fun. Is it gonna yeah. be fun? Yeah, the deer can be aggressive sometimes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They really want those biscuits. Yeah, we'll be careful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is there any like a uh, fun plan? Going to Universal Studios. Yeah. Yeah. Super Mario World. Um, <laughs> that museum. Are we going to Team Lab? I've seen all the sites in Tokyo as well. Yeah, I'm trying to see everything. I think we'll go to Shibuya Sky. Have you ever uh, tried like, Japanese food? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 There's, there's quite good Japanese food in London. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. that's well. It's actually quite yeah. nice Japanese food. There's good sushi. It's probably going to be better here, though. So yeah. All we've yeah. had to eat so far is this bottled water. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because like, you just uh, run there. Yeah, 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 it's London. <laughs> We're just waiting for our Airbnb to be ready. <laughs> I'm gonna be excited. Yeah, yeah it's gonna be really good. I'm just gonna go around the trains. Yeah. Get we're we're staying in an onsen hotel in Nara. Uh, Should be nice. So for yeah. one night, because it's very expensive. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The Fisher sure hotel is always yeah. 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 expensive. Thanks for your interview. No worries, Alma. Yeah. Thank you for your YouTube channel calls. Ah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. 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 たくさんのコメントお待ちしておりますチャンネル登録応援お願いします